In this video, you're going to learn how to find out if your property is in a floodplain. Um, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go back to HAR Infusion, and then this is the property I want to look at, 2015 CS Trail Lane. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to open up Realist. So you have River Public Records and click on Realist. And there we go, it opens right there. So I'm going to go ahead and do put um, put that address in, 2015 CS Trail Lane. You may not need to put that lane, but we'll go ahead and click on search and see what pulls up. Okay, perfect. So here is my realist report. This isn't actually what I want to see, so I'm going to just hit close report. Um, and it puts it on a map for me. So now I'm going to zoom out and we can see that this is spring trails right here. Um, now to be able to find out if it's in a floodplain, what you're going to do is right over here, you're going to click on my search and then this allows these buttons to become, um, you can click on them now. So now if I click on boundaries and then right down here at the bottom it says flood zone. If I click on that, Now you can see that it pulls up the different floodplains. Um, and then this is your, your key that shows you or tells you what each of them mean. So this is in the yellow. And if I scroll this way, it says it's in a 500-year five, floodplain. Um, so knowing that it is in a floodplain, what you're going to need to do is contact a local um, insurance agent and just ask them what kind of coverage will your clients have to have if it's in a 500 year old floodplain. Um, and we do have on our website, we have some preferred vendors. I'm just gonna let this mm -hmm. come through real quick. So you can see it's really close to this purple, which would have been a 100 year floodplain. And then you have the yellow, which is a 500 year floodplain. Um, there is a difference between the two and the coverage that they might have to have could be different. So like I said, definitely contact your local real estate, or I'm sorry, your local insurance agent. Um, and then if you go to our Grow Coaching website right here on Preferred Vendors, if you click on that and then click on Insurance, we have an insurance agent um, right here that is one of our preferred vendors. So you could reach out to them and then ask them about the flood insurance. And um, of course, if your your clients already have somebody specific they want to use, reach out to their, their person as well. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know.